Nowadays, a lot of uh, reviewers and readers and publishers compare me to Stieg Larsson and Jon Esper. They shouldn't, you know. I'm Jussi Adler Olsen. I'm all by myself on my own platform. Uh, this is not the mainstream Scandinavian thriller or crime story, if you like. This is perhaps a little more hmm, filled with humor, special plots, and not the usual melodramatic, depressing, gray tone of the Scandinavia as you are used to read. So please don't compare me to anyone. Just read it for my own sake and your own sake, please. I was a publisher before and I saw a lot of different manuscripts. So one day I asked myself, is it really necessary for you to sit here and read the other stuff? Why not read or write it yourself? So I looked for a gap, a hole in, in the Danish market and we hadn't any thrillers. So I made a thriller and that's what I like most of all. You know, the, ac the action movies. A little Harrison Ford here and there, that's always very nice. So uh, I started with writing those political thrillers, international, not happening in Denmark, not, not with Danish main characters. And one day a producer in Denmark said to me, you need to talk a little about Denmark, my dear, because we want that. So I invented Karl Merck, the guy sitting in the cellar. And this was a quite new line for me. I have even been so happy and, well, lucky that I had all the, the awards last year and this year that one could dream of as an author. I mean, we're talking about the Reader's Prize, the Retailer's Prize, and even the prize of the literary establishment. That means that everyone, some way, likes the books. They love the characters. And uh, this is the best prize for me. I mean, to have readers thinking of the characters exactly the same way as I do, that's fantastic. And now there's a production team, a very fantastic one, going to make the movies too. So hurry up, read the book before you see the movie.